Google may have created the world's first true artificial intelligence, and some are saying that this is exactly the technology that Stephen Hawking warned would end humanity, but we'll talk about it. What Hawking was warning us about is that true artificial intelligence, one that can make decisions for itself and then could self-propagate, would far surpass humanity's abilities. Biological life has time periods it needs in order to evolve. Our squishy bodies are fragile. AI doesn't need to wait till a child is born who's capable of figuring out the answer to a topic. It can try millions of different possibilities and then keep on moving. What they created is something akin to life, a primordial soup of code that's allowed to exist autonomously and randomly. It also behaves in a contagious manner. This is very similar to how genetic drift works. With no selection pressure, genes just randomly pop up and exist in the population. This is a very big step forward. Autonomous action is one of the things that AI really misses. What this lacks is selection pressure, some pressure to become something, and it will be interesting to see where they go from there. Autonomous action is what makes living robots so interesting. The idea that adding that hint of life could create what I would like to call non-canonical intelligence. Could this kind of technology lead to the ultimate end of humanity? What Stephen Hawking was worried about was that self-propagation would work exactly like evolution. Once it really got started, we would end up with autonomous robots making decisions and making decisions about what's best for them, which might not be people. It's a step forward, not the end of the world.